Now, more from our campaign 2010 Eyewitness News exclusive poll. The race to replace Congressman Patrick Kennedy is coming down to the wire. Our poll has revealed only a few points separate Democrat David Cicilline and Republican John Laughlin. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly joins us now with the results. He's live outside the State House with Providence Mobile Newsroom. Sean. Yes, Karen, after Republican Scott Brown won the late Senator Ted Kennedy's seat in January and after his son Patrick chose not to run for re-election, the question has been, might that seat go to a Republican as well? And you know what, Mayor? That's not what campaigns are about. It's become an increasingly aggressive race for Congress in Rhode Island's first congressional district. Republican John Laughlin running against Democrat David Cicilline. Now, our exclusive Eyewitness News poll shows David Cicilline is up by only 6, 48% to 42% for John Laughlin. 10% aren't sure. In September, 22% weren't sure, and David Cicilline had the same 48% he still has. And so all the undecided voters in our survey have gone to John, John Laughlin. Which and says he has the momentum. He definitely has momentum going into the last week of the campaign. What's going on? Well, I think it's just as more Rhode Islanders are paying attention to the race and more Rhode Islanders are taking a good hard look at the message, uh, they realize that, uh, that in fact, I represent the ability for us to change course in Washington and to, to restrain some of that spending. These numbers suggest you could win. Uh, we will win, Sean. Obviously, I don't take anything for granted. I'm out here working hard you every day to get You don't take anything for granted. Do you think you could lose? Look, I'm going to continue to work really hard to earn the vote of every single voter in this district, and we'll know on November 2nd. There's a chance that John Laughlin could win this race. He's in position right now where he wants to be. When you're a Republican, you want to be surging at the end. And right now, our polling data shows John Laughlin surging. First, Ted Kennedy's Senate seat went to a Republican, and now Patrick Kennedy's House seat may go to a Republican in a race the country is watching. Live at the State House with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.